What's up guys and welcome back. When last we left off, we went around and did a bunch of the power struggles. Well, attempted. Oh, not even a bunch. We only did a couple really. I don't know. <laughs> but uh, during my run around getting used to the controls, uh, this time I went around and got all the uh, Athildans and artifacts in the area. And I did record it and I figured I'd just throw it in. Uh, but it's kind of long. It's kind of like 14 minutes long. <laughs> and the, there was only a couple of Thildans left, but there's quite a few artifacts. And, you know, those have the talking and everything, so... It just made it a little bit longer. <laughs> and I figured I'd just throw it into this video and then, uh, do the side missions. Uh, just the bow ones. And then after that, we'll do the storyline for a while. Like just drill into it just because we have uh, quite a bit of the other stuff done <laughs> and I guess that's my cue this is my first time doing a proper voiceover I normally just like cut out whatever my gameplay is while I'm talking and just kind of make it look like a voiceover <laughs> it's kind of weird This uh, whole running around grabbing all the Thildans and artifacts took about a half hour, like a whole episode length, and I was like, no, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna put out a whole episode of nothing but grabbing all this really little stuff. So I figured, you know, I'd just, I'd just uh, cut it down and everything, and, and try and get the most out of the video that I can, or try and get as much of the video as I can. I don't even know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> I was thinking about uh, starting to record ahead with Mordor, like and try and get it finished as soon as possible. Uh, even though, and still like release it on the same like one every three day schedule, uh, just so I can have a little bit more one on one time with Inquisition, because there's a lot to it, and. <laughs> I'm kind of just like I don't even know just gl uh, gliding over it just skimming by <laughs> just kind of just hoping everything makes sense in the end <laughs> so I definitely need a little bit more one on one time with it mm, games are coming out faster than I can play them it, do it does take me a little while to play them just because of the one every three days not worth everything I try to record like stay like two up so like when this comes out, I'll be two ahead, like in real time. <laughs> I just have a bunch of games on my list that I want to record and don't have enough time between this and my full-time job. These men are not soldiers. They are not ready to die. All things that live must die. Man alone faces the mystery of what is beyond death. I want to at least do the uh, Tales of the Borderlands and Game of Thrones episodes. Uh, and get those out of the way and everything, you know, so I can put them up. Like, maybe after this and just throw them out because it's not very long. You know, it won't take long, but it will give me enough time to record another. Yeah, found it, you new dude. What is it? They got these machines, see? And they're digging up everything, you new dude. They tear the land up. Then the slaves pick through everything. 
clay and mud go to the kilns. If they find metal, that goes to the forges. Anything they can use, they take back. And if they find an old weapon or piece of armor, they hand it off to the Urukai, the brigands. Maybe to study, maybe to wear. I don't know. They're on the move for sure. We must know what is happening in Bordeaux. We have other eyes there, but yours are sharp. You serve us well. You will return there and report back. The Council must not learn of your actions. Do not get caught. I wonder who's talking to who in that one. <laughs> I don't know. But, yeah, I want to get the those two just because I heard they're really good. For years we stood on top of the Black Gate looking into Mordor, seeing nothing. We were asleep. The murderous rhythm of the Dark Lord's war machines will awaken all. We must break them. I've seen uh, uh, people on Twitch and stuff play the first season but I've been staying away from everything else just so it's all like new to me and because those type of games you, you can't know what's gonna happen it just ruins it <laughs> and then I've been playing a bunch of Dying Light and I, I really want to record that but it's so far out there like so long away <laughs> uh, then I have a whole like a uh, bookshelf full of games that I bought because I wanted to record them. I have a bunch of games that I, I buy and I, I don't even touch because I don't want to know anything about them because they would ruin the experience, you know? So it's kind of weird. I need to stop buying games when I can't play them. <laughs> oh, this place is, or this part is cool, because I didn't know you could shoot rocks. <laughs> and I was like, what? What the hell is going on? And it says it's right here. <laughs> and I'm like, oh, I get it now. talking about anymore. <laughs> Yeah, if uh, you guys have any suggestions, like, I, sh I, I know I could be commentating a lot better, but I'm just trying to get used to it. Uh, I've been trying to get my friends to get into recording just because it would be easier for me to, like, banter back and forth with them, like, here trying to participate with me instead of just trying to bullshit. Well, I, I want them to bullshit, just the right kind of bullshit. Oh no, they're not taking the bait though. They say the enemy is weak on the left, and that the dwarves will tear through them there. Maybe then we can leave these filthy marshes and go home. Yesterday, the enemy made a call for parley. We saw the emissary's party ride out, a terrible black figure atop a black horse, and flanked by two huge men. Similarly clad in black. They were not allowed to ride among our lines. Amid suspicion, they would scout our disposition and report back to their vile master. Instead, a small group of elves and men rode out to meet him. We could not hear what was said, but there will be no peace. Around 
the camp there are whispers. They say the emissary's mouth blackened and burned with Sauron's words, and that saying them caused the emissary great pain. He promised only slavery and toil, and I am compelled to believe it. I cannot help but think we will never make it into Mordor. Only death awaits us here. And if you, uh, if there's like a bunch of breaks in this where I'm not talking, it's because I went back and edited out like the bullshit I'm saying, like where where I get tongue tied or where I just say something that's just pointless. <laughs> uh, but I don't know. Uh, eventually, I'll. Yeah, I'd like to. Yeah, I that he saw ghosts on the dead marshes. I thought he just saw his own fear. The sleepless dead, the shadow men, the dead ones. Mordor calls to them all. Eventually, I would like to get to the point where I don't care, or I'm good enough to where I, I trust it. <laughs> um, I would like to eventually get into like Twitch streaming, just because then it's all like on the fly, and I can like talk to the people in the chat to kind of keep conversations going. But I don't think I'm up to that point yet. <laughs> Plus, by that point, I would want to be on a schedule. Farazon. He's been sold a bill of goods, all right. And what do we get? More war, more taxes. Ha! Human sacrifice in the town square. You can hear the screams all day and all night. And we're made to worship this, this hideous thing. The great tree kindling. The king's ears filled with rubbish from his, his advisor. The great chain wonder Sauron, now princely Sauron. Island Dale is right. Numenor is ruined. And the boats can't take us away from this charnel house fast enough. <laughs> but yeah, I would, I would like to get more, uh, like, I don't know, more talking. Uh, but uh, it's weird because I'm not. The first Dark Lord of Middle-earth. The great enemy. Sauron was his servant, and was loyal to the end and beyond. Like, I'm not a big talker. <laughs> I, it, on the internet, I'm mostly a lurker. I mostly just watch or listen or read. I don't participate in conversations on the internet, really. Like, even very much in real life, unless someone has, a, like, a subject that I know through and through, I normally just stick to light conversation just I don't know <laughs> I'm weird remember me filth ha! what the change of plans lads I'm in charge and we're gonna tear the black hand up don't you forget about me oh yeah right my uh memory's not that good <laughs> imagine that well, that's the last one, and right now I go through and, like, check my mini-map and everything. Well, I have to go back to hear this real quick. How can man hope to stand against these Uruk? They are filled with such pure hate. We will teach them the meaning of fear, and in that we will give hope to Middle-earth. Yeah, uh, I'm gonna go out to a map view and show that I got everything, and then it's gonna cut back to, I guess, real-time as far as the recording is concerned <laughs> like because right now i'm voicing over afterwards <laughs> but hope you guys have a good day and then uh i figured this time we'll uh damn. we'll upgrade because i need the brutalize ability uh, to open up a couple of the dagger missions that are that are left, so I figured get that, and then we have enough Mordor points to get this whole row, the whole third row. So I figured go ahead and do that. <laughs> and then go over here. No. 
nice. <laughs> Alright. So what do we want? 30 plus? That's kind of ridiculous. It's not bad. It's not bad either, but we'll pick that one. While riding. That would be good for that uh, sword mission, the sword side mission. 12%. Oh, that that is a duplicate. Oh. Convert. Yes. Get that one. And it's a pretty good chance. Recover focus with a headshot. Yeah, that's a good one. <laughs> and oh, I thought these were duplicates. Well, I did just get the brutalize thing, so that could maybe come in handy. Cover focus on the shanks. Recover health from a drain. Ooh, that might be a good one. What was this one again? I'm gonna get Elt shot back. But a brutalized kill has to be done in stealth, so I probably won't need it. Let's go ahead and try this. And then, while we're already in the menus, figured I'd show you where we are. We've only done 11 um, main missions. <laughs> no sword side missions at all. And then, see, all the Athildans and artifacts in my area is only like around half. So, I'm wondering if there's another area I go into, like maybe over to that one blonde chick's city or wherever she's from. <laughs> go ahead and do that. See where I'm going. <laughs> I was gonna intervene, but then I'm gonna. I need to keep an eye out for the yellow mushrooms. I need that for the alchemy challenge. Is that a war chief right there? Bunch of guards. Alright. Now. So I can't leave this bubble. Oh, it's a captain. <laughs> Damn, I've only killed five. Oh, gonna get it on him. Oh, it's the. I thought it was the blue guys I had to kill. Damn, I, I was just wasting time. Oh, come on.
Man, that sucks. Oh, it's giving it back to me instantly. Man, can't do a long range shot to save my life. Come on, a little bit further. Thank you. Couldn't have done without you. One more. <laughs> Is that ahead? Thank you. <laughs> it's harder than it had to be. I wonder if I should go and kill that captain. I mean, I'm right here. Well, he has full health. It's not the objective today. <laughs> <laughs> Any enemy who thinks they can bet <laughs> me in battle is in for a surprise. That's what I thought. Oh, there's slaves. I haven't seen slaves I could free in a long time. I gotta free him. <laughs> free. There was a brawl between some of the other prisoners. Alright. Yeah, you shouldn't think about it. It's probably not good. <laughs> Let's hurry up and get this ability. What do I need? I don't even know what the branding even is. But I kind of feel like I should save my ability points for one of these better ones. That could be needed. Alright. Oh, only 150 Mordor points? Must be easy. Just have to locate him. I don't have to fight him. It doesn't sound right. Let me go ahead and switch over that rune. Was it sword? I'm gonna switch this one. Oh, it definitely wasn't sword. <laughs> yep. What am I getting rid of? For a headshot kill? Alright. Hopefully, this will go a little bit better than the side mission. <laughs> Ten of them? With arrows? Son of a bitch. Oh, come on. Oh. Your armor went away, buddy. Come out 
the Halo music. Oh, it gave it to me. Nice. I was like, what? <laughs> oh man, yellow mushroom. Don't have time. <laughs> I'm glad that the plant life comes back, like whenever you load a new game, or it's probably like load a new scene, but I'm glad it does, it's just not there anymore. Why are you crying, buddy? Two more way over here. What? Starting this mission. I d um, what? <laughs> That's confusing. Oh man. Bad idea. Bad idea. <laughs> I think uh, this time included with the going and get the, the Thildens and artifacts, I think we should be at about time. <laughs> uh, and next time we'll go straight for the main missions and uh, do a couple of them, try and get a bunch of it done. But thank you guys for joining me and thank you guys for watching. <laughs> Um, next time, or next time, <laughs> next video is in the top right, last video is in the top left, subscription button's down below, let me know what you think, Young Obi, signing out.